Hello everyone, this is a Draven Guide. This video will include abilities, masteries, matchup, item order, pros and cons. Now, let's together take a look at the pros and cons of Draven. First look at the pros, strong laner, heavy AD damage, very hard to stop once ahead, decent mobility, and now cons. Vulnerable to CC, very hard to master, bad from behind, relies on cash in, short range. Now, let's take a look at the champion mastery page together. Here you can make adjustments according to your own play style. Draven is a strong laner already, but with Hail of Blades, he becomes even stronger. Hail of Blades allows for better trades in lane than Conqueror and also surprises enemies outside of lane with the short burst of attack speed it gives. How to utilize Hail of Blades most effectively is by having two spinning axes and activating a third once you proc it. Lethal Tempo on Draven is a replacement for Conqueror. In my opinion, it's stronger in lane if you get to stack it and utilize the range and attack speed it gives, but Conqueror is way stronger in late. I don't have too much experience with Lethal Tempo, but I am guessing it's good. The same game's Conqueror is good, so basically versus tanks or melee champs where you can get in a lot of autos. I would recommend going Lethal Tempo if you have an Enchanter as support or anything that will make you go into extended fights so you can get more value of it. At the end of the day, it's up to you to decide which rune will give you the most value since every game is different. Personally, I play with Lethal Tempo in all my games. Depending on the opponent's situation and the game's composition, you can make these selections. You can choose Doran's Blade, Health Potion, and Stealth Ward as your starting items. After 5 minutes, for your early item pick, you can go for Serrated Dirk and Boots. Up to 20 minutes, you can consider purchasing the Collector, Infinity Edge, and Berserker's Greaves. For your full build, after getting Bloodthirster recently, you can continue with Lord Dominic's Regards and Guardian Angel. Q Spinning Axe. Draven's main ability. The axes always goes in the direction you are facing after auto-attacking. The mana cost, 45, stays the same at all levels. You can have two spinning axes and activate a third to get three auto-attacks of with Hail of Blades. If your axes are running out and you are forced to take poke to keep them alive, do that. Draven has more sustain than any other ADC with Doran's Blade, so when you are laning, value your mana more than your HP. W Blood Rush. When Draven catches a spinning axe, Blood Rush cooldown is refreshed. The mana cost decreases after leveling up this ability. Mana cost is high early, so only use when necessary. Blood Rush gives attack speed and movement speed, so use when trading or catching up to enemies. Blood Rush grants Ghost, which allows you to pass through other units. E stand aside, stand aside, first knocks back, and then slows for depending on level. Has high cooldown, so only use when it's needed. If thrown and hit on the right side of your target, it will knock your target to the left and vice versa. Use this to position your target where you want it. When using stand aside and hitting an enemy, it counts as an airborne. During airborne, enemies cannot move, attack, or use abilities. You can use this this to your advantage. For example, if you're facing an Echo with low HP and he is ready to ultimate, you can use Stand Aside and an auto attack to finish him up before he gets the chance to use his ultimate. Stand Aside can also be used to cancel certain abilities. For example, Pantheon W or LeBlanc W. R Whirling Death. Whirling Death is a global ultimate. This means you can use it to kill people across the map. Always when ulting long distances, recast your ultimate right before it's about to hit an enemy to make it harder to dodge. Keep in mind that the axes deal 8%, less damage for each enemy hit, down to a minimum of 40%, however damage fall of resets after reversing direction. Also keep in mind that your ultimate is an execute. If the enemy target's HP is lower than your stacks, Draven will execute them. 